What up, Gerbo fam? Welcome back to another video. It's been a long time since I've said that line. My first reaction video of 2019. Yay! Oh, and blood. If you have not seen my hair transformation video, even though it's looking kind of crushed right now, you look at my ends, but you can just be touching in a week or so. Um, I'll link it down below, in the description down below, I'll link it there. But I'm back with another reaction video. I've been meaning to record some reaction videos for some songs that have, been, um, that have come out since the beginning of the year, but I've just, I don't know, just didn't. <laughs> I can't put it any, any other way, I just didn't. Um, um, and today, I'm excited because like, what better way to come back than with a reaction video to Rosalia and J Balvin's new song, Con Altura. I'm also gonna be reacting to I by uh, Mauro Bautista featuring Vice Menta. Before we start this video, give this video a big thumbs up if you love music like I do, because I know you do, and that's why you're watching this video. Do you think you're gonna like this song? Just comment down below, let me know before I actually show you my reaction to it. Uh, okay. uh, I was not ready. I was not ready. Uh, okay, I guess I'm gonna start with I uh, by Mario Bautista y Vicemental. Let's go. <laughs> I love that song. Uh, Vice Memphis verse is my, my favorite, obviously. Um, but it was cool, it was dope. A little different from usual. And a little techno in it with, you know, the urban flair. But yeah, I like this song a lot. Oh my god, I was, I was, I'll give this song, if I were to rate it from like a 1 to a 10, I will give this song, um, I'll give it a 7.5. Because it's a, it's, it's a, it's, it's a good song. I like it a lot. But am I going to be playing it over and over again? Maybe not. I'll like, play it once in a while, yes, for sure. But no, it's not going to be on repeat, if I don't know yet. But it's a good song. I liked it a lot. Next is Con Artura by Rosalia and J Balvin and I'm such a fan of Rosalia like since I heard her on J Balvin's album um, Brillo I think was the song like I was hooked on her and then she released Malamente and then her album which was, which was dope AF I love her album I listen to it all the time so I'm excited what this is gonna be so let's go Con Artura Rosalia J Balvin featuring El Guincho okay let me just say I loved Rosalia's voice. I loved her part the most. Don't attack me. Don't no. Just just don't. Okay. I love J Balvin. Um, I don't know who the guy is. I don't know who he is, um, but I'm pretty sure he's famous somewhere. Yeah, no shade. <laughs> but I love J Balvin, but Rosalia just took the song to a different level. Her voice is very unique, it's very like flamenco ish. Kind of because she is from like that area, that part of the world, Spain, I think. Um, I should do my research, I should Google search before I start these videos. <laughs> anyway, I just love her voice, and her part is just it, like it grabs your attention, like it grabs your attention. Rosalia, I just, she just made the song. She just made the song, honestly, I can't lie. If I were to rate this song, I would. 8.5 yeah i'll do an 8.5 i think that's fair before i end this video i do want to give like special mentions to people that um, have released music and i haven't been i didn't do reactions to it i'm sorry because i know you depend on me for yourselves <laughs> <laughs> Hello. um but yeah then just released a new album the one um i didn't download all the albums sorry. um i did get calenton asumba yandel berreito light tequila bom pom y tamare are my one two three four five six favorite songs of the album those are my favorite ones you guys should check them out camilo he has a a song with uh, Mario Ricky the Tonosidos. He just released a song last night. Um, 
called Not the Vayas, and that song is pretty dope too. Danny Ocean released an album last week, I believe. Uh, 54 plus one, what it's called? Dope. Dope. Uh, my God, he's uh, such a genius with his, with, his, with his music. It's just amazing. I love his album a lot, a lot, a lot. I actually recorded a video to Duele by Drake and Wisini and then, but I wasn't feeling <laughs> the song a lot and I didn't end up editing it or uploading it. I just did the file off my camera. Um, but yeah, I wasn't a big fan of the song. I really wasn't. Um, but yeah, I did record that reaction, but I did not upload it because I felt like it was very lackluster and I was very like, uh, the whole video because I wasn't feeling the song. Like it was, it's an okay song, it's just not. It's not Amores con Derechos or Arraptame or um, Es que me nieva perderte jamás nunca. It's not, it's not, it's not like those songs that like, you're, you know? So yeah, it was very, uh, very mediocre. Uh, Raki Mika White are back. If you did not know, they just released a song called Una Noche Mas and it's pretty dope too. I liked it a lot. A song that I thought very weird on myself to download was MC's, MC Magic's new song called Sam featuring Google and Lil Rob. I actually enjoyed the song. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I enjoyed the song. It's very weird because I've never listened to it before. A week ago, I think. A week or two. Another song I've been listen, listening to on repeat and actually uploaded a cover on my IG, which I'll link down below. Is the Spuske de Berlin by John Z, and he did a remix to it with Enrique Iglesias, and it's amazing. I love that song. Uh, Mauro Ricky just um, also released a song called Perdona Me, and it's a beautiful song. Beautiful song. Ooh, Coast City, Salvaje, that song. Oh my god, I, I've been thinking about putting a song, but it's kind of it's a very tricky song. But I love that song so much. Yes, man, I love, 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 love. A song I did not really enjoy was I Can't Get Enough with Selena Gomez and J Balvin and Tiny and Benny Blanco. I didn't like that song. Don't come for me. Um, nothing like that shall out uh, release an album. And Oh Daddy is one of my favorite ones. Te lo dije is a good song. La mejor versión de mí is a beautiful song. Beautiful lyrics. Very, very, very well. But Oh Daddy is superior on, the, on that album. Sack. S A A K R. Release an album and that album is amazing too. I've listened to that now. I like Una Noche. Uh, featuring Jorge Blanco, I like uh, La Solución, Ways, Si Maquillaje, Karma, uh, Mala, almost all the songs, I love them. Ooh, Evie Queen uh, released an EP or album, but my top three of that EP slash album are Baile Para Ti, Malvada, and Paul Bara. Those are the three songs I downloaded. Amazing. But yeah, if you like this video, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with other music lovers or other friends that you might want to like give, give recommendations to, to listen to the songs. But yeah, let me know down in the comment section if you liked any of the, um, if you liked Dam um, Altura or I, or if you liked any of the songs that I mentioned towards the end of the video. Let me know down below, or if there's other songs that I should listen to that already came out that I haven't listened to. Or maybe I have, I just didn't mention it in the video, but yeah. Um, but yeah, let me know, know, let me know down below in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe down over there so we can keep growing. And yeah, love you guys. And that's all for today. And...